Hey guys, you're watching Boondocking with Dennis. We are going to go into Wilderness Oaks RV Resort. 361-729-2307. Overnight, weekly, monthly, or annual rates. Right here off Highway 35 in beautiful Rockport, Texas. Wilderness Oaks RV Resort saltwater swimming pool pretty neat here's the entrance got a welcome sign so I'm feeling welcome already that is awesome they got uh, American flags so that's cool Texas flag and a welcome sign stop must register at office there's first street there's the office guys pretty neat five mile an hour speed limit we will be observing so it's a nice day in Rockport mid-February we're in the 60s we're supposed to get some wind later today looks like they got little cabins down there that might be worth checking out huh kind of by the airport in case you you couldn't tell this looks to be a good sized park Let's go down this road. This is 3rd Street. We'll see what's going on. Want to get down and check out the cabins I saw. Good morning. I did not get a good morning. Uh-oh. Good morning. I got two good mornings from those gentlemen. You see? Okay. Friendly place. You guys, you guys can come stay here. <laughs> uh, it doesn't go to the left. I wanted to go to the left. Okay, I can see cabins over there. There's little cabins over there. That's interesting. So we got trees, right? We're always concerned about having trees. We got some trees here. You can see the airport is right over there. Small regional airport with a couple landing strips. What do we got? Got some birdies. I like it. Some big trees. There you go. For you people that like the shade. It's pretty full, but I do see open spots occasionally. I bet you the people that come here have been coming here for years. There's a plane. <laughs> Guys, I live here. I never even noticed this many planes. There must be something special going on today. Let's go down this road. Oh, look at that. What is this? I just like it because it's kind of old and funky. Look at that. Let me back off a little bit so you can see it. What is that? It's a Challenger from Nebraska. That's pretty neat. A Challenger MTL. That was different looking. I like that. So they got a little bit of everything in here as far as the trailers go. What is this little house here? Maybe like a bathhouse or something? Or is this for storage? Guess we're turning around here, but what do we got? A little doggy park maybe here? Yeah, a little little dog park. We're at the far edge of the and I don't know what this is. I mean, it's. I'm gonna have to wait till I back out of here so I can read that sign clearly. If you guys don't know, I am colorblind, and I'm sure normal people. I'm sure you guys can read what that says, but for me, those colors might might have as well been the exact same colors. Yep, I can't read that at all. I believe it says laundry. Laundry restrooms. Staff only. Okay, it says staff only. I can see that for some reason. Oh, well. Other than the planes zooming by, here comes another one. 
coming in on a tilt coming in hot it must be doing maybe doing a what's that exercise they do touchdowns where you land and then you come right back up and keep going could be here's the road again this goes back down here some of these people must this, this must be the full timers back here so does the road go around that way let's go let's give it a shot I like how they have those chairs painted with the little Texas flag versions. Man, my grandmother used to have chairs like that in front of her house. That style, you know. That brings back some memories from 1968. Uh, I think it ends right here. I saw an optical illusion. I thought maybe it uh, turned around, went around a curve here. <clears throat> well, how does Michael Jackson look at trailer parks? Just like this. <laughs> this is my moonwalking a trailer park right here, guys. Because there's not even turnaround room down there. This might be the road to get on, though. That's probably why it's full, huh? You get less traffic. Till boom docking with Dennis shows up with his camera. We're supposed to get, yeah, high winds. They said around 10 a.m. And it is about 10 to 10 right now. So, we shall see what happens. But I drove by this the other day and I was just curious what was going on. I will uh, look up online and see if they have a website. And if they have a website, I will stick it in the description to this video. So where is the saltwater pool, guys? I'm kind of interested. Usually they keep those up by the office, right? So does this road go through here? Let's take a chance that this road goes through. I like that color. That looks very military to me with all the covers on it. Lots of live oaks everywhere. It is quiet. I do see people moving around, though. You can tell by the flags, the wind is just picking up a little bit. Just a little bit. And this is the road we drove down before. So do I have a horrible, horrible dad joke in my memory? I do. Unfortunately for you guys, I do. I like seeing people's setups so I can think about what they're doing wrong. <laughs> Let me just stop and tell them. It is a nice Winnebago, though. Someone broke into my house last night, stole my bedside, my bedside lamp, my parrot, and my rooster. I don't know how they sleep at night. Yep, that was the joke, folks. That was the joke. Good morning. I got waves. So we're back to the office area. I see a lot of people walking around here that we don't always see at the RV parks. Good morning. Good morning. Uh, I got two good mornings. Because I use my sexy voice. Good morning, ladies. Hello, ladies. <laughs> hmm. So what do you think, guys? Wilderness, 
RV resort. Thank you. Uh, they got a thank you sign. I like the American flags I'm seeing. They got a missing in action flag. There you go. There you go, guys. Very nice. There's a rocking, folding rocking chair right there. They got dumpsters for you to put your trash in. That is convenient. So, is this a road? Yes, yeah, this is a road. Making sure I'm not pulling into a spot. Well, somewhere here, guys, there's a saltwater swimming pool. I can't quite find it, but... I gotta say, this is not a bad park at all. What do they got there? They got their purple lights on the ground. Oh, dead end. I gotta turn around again. Alright guys, Wilderness Oaks RV Resort. 361-729-2307. And I promise you, somewhere here, there's a saltwater swimming pool. Thanks for watching.